What's good guys again? It's your boy Josiah. It's your boy Jonathan. It's your boy Sean. Yes sir, we are back here at the what fest? Origi Fest. Origi Fest. Yes sir. Origi. Shout out to Chris Morgan for pulling up. Fuck off, I'm talking bruh. Anyways, shout out to- Fuck you! Anyways guys, I Ignore this neglect. Anyways, <laughs> shout out to- <laughs> Anyways. Shout, shout out to Chris Morgan okay, for yeah, pulling this shit off. Like, yeah, it's really- Tough, tough, we're tough, really tough. Grateful. Yeah. We appreciate it. We, we enjoy the show. Guys, if it does, guys, there's a lot of interviews. Most, most of the people you guys know them. Yes, like, you know the vibes. Yes. Shout out to Ne. She put most of these interviews. Yes. Like, you know the vibes. She's the main girl, man. She's the main yep. girl. You get She's me? Girl, it's looking good, bruv. <laughs> Don't make this shiny sh- sh- go viral, bruv. I'm quitting YouTube, bruv. I'm leaving, bruv. <laughs> Anyways, don't, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, yeah. send it to your mother so that she can send it to your father, then they watch and laugh. You know the vibe. send it to your uncle. Yeah. But we are going as well. But yeah. yeah. But don't send it to their parents like these two. <laughs> yeah, ne, don't do them. Pull up and wear my G's, man them whipping, I need no keys You still tripping like overseas, rats in the trap and they want that cheese I say pull up and with my G's, man them whipping, I need no keys You still tripping like overseas, rats in the trap and they want that cheese And I'm so in it, I keep this straight like Dennis I make my pay my business, gang on camp Yo, what's up, bro? Uh, it's your boy Jonathan, today I'm here with Cordial, what's good? I'm your black guy, you know, the black knight, shining armor But anyways, yeah, what's up? Good, good, my guy, how are you doing? I'm doing great. I'm lit. I'm you drink? Lit. You drink the first? Oh, bro. Ah, this doesn't even count as drinking, uh, though. <laughs> so my first question for you is, what is your type? My type? Yeah. My type is my type. Just so you know. What I'm with is my type. That's it. Nothing. So it could be anybody, anything. Damn, dog. Okay, now you have to make it more vague. Um, I would say slim, thick, yeah. petite, hand with That's money so on a car. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it's a must that she has a car and money. Eh? Yeah, cause damn dog. <laughs> hey, I got my golf too. That's Both that's my feet. But anyways, yeah, she has to have something that you know. I know I have a loss. Not in these hands that'll be taking care to your place, dog. Hey. What's that? La? <laughs> like I have. Chai. So my first question for you is. <laughs> <laughs> So my first question for you is, Ne, what would you do if you were a girl for a day? Me? If I was a girl for a day, yeah. I'd be in Dubai by now, shaking my ass in a thong, bruh. <laughs> On a yacht. <laughs> On a yacht. Uh, uh, Guess who's yacht? Who? The president's yacht. What? The president's yacht. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> Oh, so yeah, what would you do, ne? If what would you do, ne? If your best friend's uh, best friend sugar mom was your father or your mom, your best friend sugar mom sugar mom was your mom, what would you do? What's the first thing you do? What's the first thing I would do? Yeah. My best friend sugar mom. Yeah, it's your mother. Ah, I would use him, bro. Cause I know for a fact my mom can't fit to be a sugar mommy at this point, but so. Since there's a possibility, mm. ah, that's how I'm gonna be getting my Zack out of that. <laughs> so you, he's basically gonna be your ATM. Exactly. Yeah. You know he gives that good dick, good head, whatever it is. Chai. Whatever magicians do. Yeah, yeah. Yes. And then boom, boom, pow. You know, it's the vibes. <laughs> <laughs> Now, now, my last question for you is now today. What's the worst thing you've done to your ex? She okay. So it went like this, right? Um, she was toxic, just so you know. Okay. So now what? What she did was, she had to play me in some kind of way, you know. Okay, but I won't, I won't, I won't go through the schematics. Okay. So what I did was we're on campus. She tried to reach back, you know, be my friend and all that shit. And then I was like, you know, pushing her away. I was telling her that we, we are not part of this conversation. And okay, I called her up to my place one night and we spoke about how toxic she was. She cried about it, she apologized about it. And then we had some good ass sex and I told her to get out of my house. Oh, that one there was a violation. Personally, I wouldn't have it. So you saw the dream, basically. Yeah, she even said I love you and I said, no, leave my house. So, but hey, guys.
Ta, ta. My guy, so what's your IG? Um, Ed Cordial underscore NA for the vibes. You know I'm on Instagram. That melanin soldier. You okay. see it, you see it, don't worry. Um, I like light skin, curly hair. Long curly hair. Why? Because they're hot. All my gents are like. Okay, no. But I don't discriminate. I don't discriminate. Ah, it's cool. It's cool. It's cool. It's right. You need to be like, like you need to be creative. You need to be an, either an artist. You need to be. Are we really doing this? Yes. <laughs> oh. You need to be an artist. Um, in all kinds of ways. Artistry just means, you know, drawing. You, you, you're a designer. You're a singer, rapper, whatever. But I'm into creatives. Okay. My next question is, what's the freakiest thing you've ever done? Sorry. Freakiest thing you've ever done. Yeah, I also had to answer. Oh, I'm a child of God. Don't do those things. Okay, what's the dirtiest thing you did to your ex? Oh and they didn't find my out. My ex? Yes. Mm. Is it, where is this going? <laughs> YouTube. Oh! Um, well, the dirtiest thing I think I've done, not to an ex, because I don't really have exes. Um, what I've done was, I just homie hopped. You fucked up, I went to your homie. Yeah, no! <laughs> it's rough! Anyways, my next question is What would you do, ne? What would you do if you found out your best friend Sugar Daddy is your father? <laughs> I would fuck both knows. of them up, bruh! My best friend knows not to fuck with me like that, ever. She knows. I would ask her to give me money also. She knows. She must, she must give me that money she's eating from my dad because my dad doesn't give me money like that. What's the worst? What like if you got you got your ex cheating on you? What's the best way to get back? Leave. I don't do revenge. Fuck his father. Oh. It was what's your IG? Um, it's just Brooklyn with two underscores. What's your IG? Khadija Herunga. Follow the people on IG. You know the vibe. Today I'm here with Maggie. How are you, Maggie? I'm okay. How are you? How are you finding the event so far? It's okay, I guess. Are you enjoying yourself? I'm drinking water, so. <laughs> okay, okay. Cool. First question. What's your type? What do you mean? In what? What way, guys? Uh, I don't have a type. I don't have a type. Okay. Yeah. Now, second question. What would you do if you found out your best friend's sugar daddy was your dad? I'll probably be done. That's too suspect. And you're dead? I threaten him. Yeah. Getting money from him, and if he doesn't want to give me, he knows what I'm going to do. Nice. Okay, cool. Um, third question, yeah? If you woke up as a guy, yeah, what's the first thing you do? If I did what? Woke up as a guy. Uh, play, probably play around with my dick. Why? I don't know. I always just wanted to know how you guys feel. About yeah. it. Yeah. Hi. Okay, cool. Last question, eh? If you found your partner cheating, eh? And you decide to fight the girl, and she fucks you up, and she tells you to join, what you join? Join. The three of us. Threesome. No. Uh, firstly, I would have fight over a guy. There's so many guys. So. Secondly, I'm not that violent. I don't fight. Thirdly, I'm not into sharing. So three sum is a no. Okay, what's your IG? Uh, Maggie with four Gs. What one today I'm joined with? Uh, Grace and Teleni. How are you guys doing? Good. I'm enjoying the event. Nice, nice. So my first question for you is, what is your type? Um, I think I'll go for someone who is hippie, more of like a nature-like person. Yeah, that's basically it. Yeah. You? Um, I guess someone who's just kind. Kind? Yeah. Care about kindness a lot. Exactly. No kind and face. respectful. And humble oh. as well. Exactly. Humble as well. Humble, yeah. yes. Not arrogant, not yes. proud. Who wants oh. an arrogant person? Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> My next question for you is, ne? what what is the worst thing you can do to your partner if you found out they cheated on you? I'll cook you horrible food. Horrible food? Yeah. In terms of what? Like just the things I think you're allergic to. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, and you? That is a bit harsh. Um, I don't know. I think I just leave because they'd want me to chase after them, and the worst thing I could do is just leave. 
you believe that's the best way to attack the soul. Okay, okay. What would you do if you were a boy for a day? Damn, that's a good question. I think I'd be a model. You know, because you guys portray a very, you know, dominant image in the, you know, photography industry. Okay. So I think I'd be that. Okay. Yeah. You? That is deep. <laughs> Um, if I was a boy for a day, yeah. um, to be very honest, the first thing I do is like play with my check what you're dealing with. Yeah, you know, to check the 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 goods, the stock, what I'm working with. <laughs> okay, okay. My last question for you is, man, what would you do if your best friend's sugar daddy is your father? Oh my god, I would just leave the situation and pray about, you know, everything I just, you know, experienced. Alright! You will not do anything about no, it? No, there's, because it's not in my control, so there's nothing I can do about it, you know. I would know my limits and I'll just end the friendship, but I'll also pray for my friend, you know. Okay. Yeah. You? Um, obviously it's none of my business, because that's between the two of them. Okay. But... No, I think I just keep quiet until they ask about it. Okay. Like, okay. you know. Okay. What's your IG? My IG? Yeah. Um, tally.sue. Ladies and gentlemen, it is day two here at the Orange Fest. I go by the name of Lady Nay, and I am here with my favorite YouTubers, my content creators. They go by the name of The Culture. All right, so I'm standing next to Phenomenal King. He goes by the name of Kev Omaro, Hella Dilemma, DBS. You already know I love you so much, Kev. Thank you, baby girl. Yes, you. I appreciate you too. Now, listen. So that culture is all about street quizzing, you know what I'm saying? And my two questions for you today is, if you were a female for one day, what would you do first? <laughs> if I'm hot, I'm definitely going to look for me because I need me a hot thing, you know? <laughs> <laughs> I see you. Yeah, um, secondly... God damn, I'll probably just go over to my boys, do all I can and just leave them hanging, you know? Huh. I see you. <laughs> you are evil. Yeah, it's, I gotta have a little fun. <laughs> I see you, I see you. So, Kevin Morrow, my second question for you is, if you found out, are you ready? <laughs> that your best friend's sugar mama, no, sugar daddy, is your father or sugar mama is your mother what would you do i don't know if your best is male or female i had to ask both god damn i mean they know my parents are off limits man like i mean do you but like shit we're throwing <laughs> you said we're throwing hands the homie we're throwing hands if it's uh my girl best friend then we definitely got to sit down and have a serious talk about it. 100%. 100%. Uh, that ain't happening. <laughs> Not around here. Shout out to you, Kevin Morrow. Thank you so much for being here at the Orange Fest. Your performance was absolutely awesome. Thank you. Thank you so much. Your stage presence is everything. That is always the highlight. You know, I think I really enjoy performing. I enjoy performing to everybody. And I think the energies were great today. It's unfortunate that we didn't finish, but yeah, it is what it is. Welcome back from South Africa, Mr. Ian. I see you looking all tight. So fineness, South Africa kept you very well. This is the Orange Fest. I go by the name of Lady Nay, and I am here with my favorite, the culture. And I got two questions for you. Ask away. <laughs> I bet. So if you were a girl for one day what would you do yo i can't say that on air yo <laughs> no the, the answers immediately came to mind but i can't say that on air I you can't. can you can you can say whatever you want damn shit. uncensored um i would explore myself firstly um secondly i would i would hope that it was my period because i've been i've Honestly, life mission, life goal. I want to experience a period. I want to know whether the pain is actually as bad as you guys make it seem it is, or whether it's just y'all being weak. That's crazy. 
I see you. I see you. Okay. My second question is. Yeah. Wait. Before I ask your question, is your best friend male or female? Uh, male. So if you found out that your best friend's sugar mama is your mother, yeah. how would you react? Uh, yeah, no, it's, it's cancel culture. I'll cancel my best friend and I'll cancel my mother. It's done. Wow. It's done. Wow. Why would you do that? The, oh, the principle. There is so much wrong in that as it is. <laughs> Full stop. I don't even need to explain myself. Think about it. Your best friend is sleeping with your mother. How does that look? No. It looks no. definitely off. <laughs> no, it's wrong. It's wrong. It's wrong. So All right. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much, Ian, for joining us here at the Orange Fest featuring the culture. We definitely love the culture. Do like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I am here with Vintuk Namibia's South Africa International's Most Wanted. He goes by the name of Page Ethnics. Two million likes, no, no, no. Correction, two billion likes, because that's where we're heading, that's where we're heading. We are here at the Orange Fest with Page Ethnics. Not on, he's not alone, but he's with Esho Ethnics, right? Yes. Okay, so this is the culture. We usually do the street quiz type of thing. And I got two questions for you. Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm ready. I, <laughs> okay, cool. If you were female for one day, yeah. what would you do first? What would I do? Yeah. <laughs> Yo! Problem! <laughs> You are the danger. <laughs> hey man, am I supposed to be vocal or not? You you can uncensored. Uncensored. This is uncensored. Okay, cool. Uh, I would pl probably play around with the genitalia so that I understand how it works. All right. Okay. Because I understand a lot of men don't know how it works. True. That's my honest truth. Do you know how it works? <laughs> what do you think? No comment. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> my last question is, is okay, wait, before I ask the last question, do you have a male or a female best friend? Uh, male best friend. Okay, cool. So if you found out that your best friend, your best friend's sugar mama is your mother, how would you react? Uh, hey, I'm gonna kill that boy, man. <laughs> I'm gonna kill that boy, no cap. What's that? It's like a fire. Kill man them. Yeah, kill them man them. <laughs> For real though. Why, man? Hey, this is my mother. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm raised by a single mom, so... Hey, that's that's like my number one woman in the whole entire world, you yeah. know? So, hey, that's very sacred, so I'm a... Hey, I'm a... Hey, <laughs> I'm kidding. I hear you. Yes. Page Ethnic says he will kill a man dem yeah. if he finds out that his mama is dating his best friend. So, best friend, you better be careful because Page Ethnics is coming for you. <laughs> I thank you so much. You look absolutely amazing as usual. Great stage presence, great performance. We love you so much. Ondiko ole man fele ne angelo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They pull up and wear my G's Man them whipping, I need no keys You still tripping like overseas Rats in a trap and they want that cheese I say pull up and whip my G's Man them whipping, I need no keys You still tripping like overseas Rats in a trap and they want that cheese And I'm so in it, I keep this straight like Dennis I make my pay my business Gang on